Welcome back everyone, Tina here and in this video today I'm going to show you the improved email campaign flow. Inside the summary page of the email campaigns you can now see the preview of the email you're about to send out as well as warnings for spam alerts. So what's new? You can now create email campaigns directly from the template section. There also is a checklist for missing or incorrect fields so you can fix those before sending that email. And the user interface has been improved as well on the send or schedule screen. Let me show you where you can access this. So first click on marketing on the left, click on emails at the top, select campaigns. Then you see three tabs at the top, stay with campaigns, click plus new, and then select email marketing templates. Once you've selected your template of your choice, let's go with this pink one for now, hit continue. The system will add the template to your email campaigns folders and sections. And to that, here you can start editing your template, add your content, drag and drop elements from the left over. Let's pretend we are ready to send, click send or schedule at the top right corner. And here you can see the new user interface on the send and schedule page, which is this area here. And here the usual screen where you add your key details, add your sender name and your subject line. You can also use content AI to create a subject line. Then add your preview text. It's optional, but always, always, always add it. It just helps to increase the open rate. Then choose your contacts. Always track your clicks. Why not? And turn on UTM tracking if you wish to track your UTM parameters. Now, top right corner, you see preview in browser. You can see send test email and you see the spam score. The spam score is coming soon, but here on the right hand side, if you hover over the email template, you can see that there is an edit button showing up. If you click this, you can again edit your template and you go back to the previous screen. Let's go back to send or schedule top right corner and you'll be back at the send or schedule page. Now let's click on preview in browser and you can see how your email would look like when people open it. Here you can send a test email. It pulls immediately the data that you've added on the left hand side. And here you can also attach a file if you wish to. Now let's say we forgot to add a sender name. Let's remove that. Let's remove the subject line as well. Already tells you here subject field is empty, but let's say for some reason you ignore this message. Let's preview and send. And then here is the required fields. Warning, hey, this is critical. The sender information is not verified and the subject line is missing. Oh, and by the way, this is another warning. You should better go and add your unsubscribe link. Okay. So these are all the things that we need to fix before we send that email. Now you can click the verify now button right here. In order to verify that email address, it will send a code to the given email address, which you then can enter here and it will verify your address. Now let's add the code real quick, hit verify, and you can see the email address has been verified. Awesome. Now let's hit review and send again. And here you can see the email warning that the sender information is not verified has been removed because we just verified it. Still, the subject line is missing and the unsubscribe link is also missing. Really great points to help us increase our delivery rates inside of our email marketing inboxes, right? Sending bulk emails is pretty easy. Everyone can do it, but not everyone can manage to land in the primary inbox and some people land in spam. So in order to reduce that spam rate and increase your delivery rate, we've implemented this new feature. I hope you will like it and I'll see you in the next video.